once a valve is damaged, it's a physical uh, abnormality of the valve that then has to be addressed. No medicine can make the stenosis or the leak go away uh, when the valve uh, reaches that point where uh, the patient is symptomatic and by all the numbers, the uh, degree of stenosis is severe. This is a point where we need to really go in there and take care of the valve one way or the other. The two options, again, we'll take aortic stenosis uh, at this point in time would be surgical valve replacement or what's called transcatheter aortic valve replacement or TAVR for short. And that's where we actually deploy a valve through a puncture in the groin just like when we uh, perform a heart catheterization. The old valve is pushed out of the way. We pace the patient very rapidly and the heart is almost standing still. So that way we know the precise position and it only takes a few seconds to deploy the valve. And then we turn the pacemaker off and the, the patient returns to the normal heart rhythm. The new frame opens up with the tissue inside it and starts to work immediately getting to the point where a patient's going home the same day, so you come and have your valve in the morning and go home in the evening, which is a far cry from, you know, 20, 30 years ago, it used to be 10, 10 days in the hospital and a very prolonged recovery.